What's the weather like? Or how is the weather? Oh, I see, I see. That's actually very short. Okay, go make a tempo. Oh Lord, how am I see? Boy, Mikey D. And this your girl Hazel. And today, what are we doing? We are doing a video. I'm teaching her Italian. Yes, how to speak Italian, even though he do not speak Italian. Even though I'm not fluent in Italian, yes. I'm still Italian, part Italian. So, I'm, and I know some words, so I'm gonna teach her them. So. so, what do we have to do? Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn post notifications on, and comment down below what other ideas for videos you have for us to do. So, let's get straight to it. If y'all know this about the Italian language, it's a romance language, like Spanish and like Latin. And you know what Italian is? Italian is a mix between Spanish and Latin. So some of the words like como esta yeah, some is of like, the word, it's similar in Spanish. Mm -hmm. And like some of my Spanish friends are like, oh, Italian's cool because it's kind of like similar to Spanish. Mm -hmm. So um, I noticed that too. So we're going to get into it. And yes, I don't have Rosetta Stone because Rosetta Stone is old school. I have, I have this thing called uh, Google Translate, right? Yes. And it translates the words, whatever I'm trying to say. And, it's, and it has a, 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 a voice so you can hear it. So the first word we're going to do, simple. Is hello, okay? Okay. So uh, hello, the basic ones. That's what we. In Italian, it's called ciao. Ciao. Like ciao you eat. Yeah, ciao. But it's spelled C so I A O. Like, it's spelled C I A O. So if I walk up to somebody that's Italian and say ciao. Yeah, they're not gonna think you're talking about food. They're gonna think uh -huh. you're talking about unless you say I want some ciao. Okay. Ciao. And this is how it sounds like. Ciao. 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 Is goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye, okay? Oh, okay, so I even learned that. I mean, I, I knew, okay, gosh, okay. It's crazy, because goodbye has the word, yeah. the first part of the word of, in, in Italian, the first part of the word is not goodbye. It's the opposite of goodbye. So I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna show, okay, so the goodbye, I don't know how, I don't know how to pronounce it, but et, et. Arrivederci. Huh, what did it say? Arrivederci. Shh. Arrivederci. Tell it's me. called arrivederci. And, 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 and the first part of arrivederci is arrive. Yeah. Not, yeah. So goodbye is goodbye is. Arrivederci. Uh, ar, ar, let's just say arrive derci. Arrive but, derci. But, but, derci. Okay. The R. Yeah. It's like, you don't you don't go arre, but you go arre. Arre. It's like uh, it's like almost a roll, but it's not. Which is weird because the first part of arrivederci is arrive. Yeah. And you're saying goodbye. Yeah. Um, my name is is the next one. My name is. This is like common. My name is. My name, my name is, is Slim Shady. You want the Slim Shadies? I just did my dating, so want the real Slim Shady? Please stand up. Please stand up. My name is in Italian is Michiamo or Michiamo, something like that. Let's see. Let me see. Michiamo. Oh, Michiamo. 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 And how do you say my name in Italian in, in, in Spanish? Como te llamas? Como estás? Or como? I don't know. I don't know. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Uh, I feel Spanish. Como te llamas? Okay, so, cool. so my name is Michiamo. 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 And in Italian, you ever hear like when people that are like another language talk, especially like Spanish or something like that, it sounds like they're talking really fast, like really yeah. fast. There's no space in their words. They just go. It's, yes. it's, 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 yeah, right. <laughs> I'm not making fun of Spanish people, but just the way y'all talk, it's it's it yeah, seems it's like, like a, a run-on like sentence. Yeah, I'm about to say like a run -on sentence. Um, what time is it? Is what I'm gonna say now. What time is it? Okay. Que hora sona? Que hora sona? Oh, it's like que hora is. Yeah, que hora sona, but it's spelled differently. Que hora is. Que hora sona? Que hora sona? Que hora sona? Que hora sona? No, you never. Okay, in Italian, in Italian, I know this for a fact already. In Italian, you never pronounce like if someone has a ch in their name. You don't pronounce it. Cha. Ca. Ca. You pronounce it cha. Cha. So like um. Oh well, no! Italian soccer players uh, like like Bernadeschi is one of the names. Bernadeschi, but it's it's his name. It's not Bernadeschi with the K. It's Bernadeschi with the C H. So Bernard, say Bernard, Bernard. and then Deschi. Deschi. Bernard but Deschi. that is at the end of it. C H E. So people don't pronounce the Bernardeschi. Uh, they pronounce the Bernardeschi, yeah. right? And the thing with um like a G N. If you have a G N, like especially like um bologna, like you know the, the food you eat bologna. Well. The way, the, where it comes from is called a place in Italy called Bologna. 
and they don't pronounce it Bologna in Italy, they pronounce it Bologna. Bologna. And it's spelled B-O-L-O-G-N-A. So if there's a G-N, so if there's a G-N and anything you hear, like Lorenzo Insigne. You don't say Lorenzo Insigne, you say oh, yeah. Insigne. It's so, Insigne. So you know that little, what's that little thing on Spanish? People's like the, the hyphens? A little hyphen, the little thing that rolls. And when you go Nya, Nya, that's what you do. So Insigne, like Romagnoli, Bologna. If y'all didn't know that, so it's a little more of a bite. What's the next one you want to do? You, you pick one out. Um... Where are we going? What's the weather? What's the weather like? What? The, now these ones gonna be longer. What's the weather like? Or how's the weather? Oh, I see. I see. That's actually very short. Okay. Come el tiempo. Oh lord. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? All right. So you sound like Ashton Kutcher trying to speak. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Come el tiempo. Come el tiempo. Como el tiempo. Como el tiempo. I know tempo is weather. You know what's crazy is when you speak English, it's so easy just to talk because if you just know English. But when you speak another language, like look, they have that like, look, like look, you can, y'all can't. Well, y'all can, y'all can. Can they see? Let me see. Okay, see, see how long that letter is. That word, that uh, that that, that sentence. the sentence is, and look how short the. <laughs> it's always like is. that. Right, it's always like short. Like what's weather like? Come on, tempo. So tempo is temperature. So that's why I probably talk fast. Yeah, that's because the senses is our senses is long, but their senses is right. short. Right. How's your day? How's your day? How is your day? How's your day? Damn, that's longer. <laughs> Come, co I don't know. Put it on there. Okay. Como? Okay, here it goes. Oh. Jornata. 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 Como? Como? Como la tua? Yeah, so it's like tua, tua, tua Taglovia. Oh, tua? yeah, yeah. So it says, Como la tua giornata. Giornata. So you don't say Gior, you say Gior. Yeah, Gior. Gior. Like, you know. Giornata. Yes. Giornata. Come la tua giornata. Say it one more time. This is how was your day? Come la tua giornata. Como la tua. <laughs> Como. Como that, la that's longer than freaking hell, the weather. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, um, uh, food. Let, let's see. Um. Is food. the food here good? Is the food here good? <clears throat> Can you pronounce that? Put it on there, because it's probably short. So it's, it, que, que bueno? Okay, so like, bueno? Yeah. Bueno it's is good. in Spanish, and bueno, bueno. is in, in, in Italian. You get it? There's, yeah. So bueno would be B-U-E-N-O, B -E -E and, yeah. and in Italian it's, there's no E, it's O. So if y'all didn't know, and in any Italian language, you'll see any, anyone's like, my, my grandma's last name is Carbone, but we pronounce it Carboni, like Corleone, right? Every Italian last name has a, a, a vowel at the end of it. You know what a vowel is? A, A, E, I, O, or U. Yeah. So, if you see an A, E, I, besides maybe like Malone, yeah. like Car Malone, like Malone, that's not, Malone is not a, uh, an Italian last name. I learned that, so every time I see something like that. <laughs> right, she, she, she points it out to me all the time, she's like, hey baby, isn't he Italian? Yeah. She'd be pointing out to me all the time, like in movies. Or like TV shows, or hey, his last name does it, 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 that crazy stuff. <laughs> like like um, how you say like Imperioli? Yeah. Like the guy that played The Sopranos. Um, so here is the food good. Il cibo qui è buono. Oh, okay, okay. So chi. Okay, that's how it is. So if 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 the beginning of the word starts with the C, the C at all, without a, without a uh, H. So if it's yeah. like CH, you pronounce it. Chi. You pronounce it ka. Ka. Like Bernadette's key, which has CH, right? But if it's C by itself, you pronounce it ch, ch, like CH. Ch, ch. So it's il, so this one's il cibo, il cibo. que i buono. Oh, so, okay, let's see, here it goes, ready, set, go. Il cibo qui è buono. See, il cibo che i buono. Il cibo qui è buono. So that's, is the food here good? So if I go to a restaurant like Olive Garden, I'm sorry, Olive Garden's like fake Italian food, everyone knows that. <laughs> like, like, if I go to like an Italian restaurant, I'm gonna say, il cibo che i buono. Oh, yeah. I did that. Because I think I, it just sounds better coming from me. Because oh, naturally, what should we do next? Uh, let's see. <clears throat> let's do. Um, how old are you? How old are you? That's good. Uh, remember how Cumpleanos is old in it's Spanish. So okay. let's see. How old are you? And then next is when is your birthday? Okay, so. <clears throat> Canti, I'm gonna say it's Canti Ani. Let me see. Canti Ani Ha. What the? Canti Ani Ha. Quanti Oh, Quanti Ani Ha. Quantiania. That's easy actually. Quantiania. Yeah. Quantiania. It's quantis. Q Q U A N T I A N N I H A I. 
Which is okay, weird. Okay, so next. Quanti on the eye. So if I go to the other one and say, hey, other, quanti on the eye. Oh, sir. How are. Oh, yeah, so this I'm just going to sir. <clears throat> sir is. Signore! Oh! oh signore! Signore and signora. signora. So, signore. Ma'am, probably. Signore. Signore is sir. And, like, padre. Mm -hmm. No, padre's dad, not sir. How do yeah. you say sir in Spanish then? I'm gonna say ma'am. Ma'am is probably signore. Though. Signora. Signora. So like A and E. Yeah. A and E. Signora. Signora, see? Signora. So, <laughs> how do you say brother? Oh, brother's Fratelli. Fratello? I think that's what I think I'm right. Yep. Fratello. Fratello. So like a name. Fratello. Fratello. You know what's watching this YouTube video? Have seen the movie The Goonies? There's a, there's a part in the, uh, in the you know, they go, go, hey, you guys. Well, remember the people that were like his, like, I guess, keeping him down in the basement? They were called the Fratellis. Mm -hmm. Okay, now how do you say sister? How do you think you say sister? Animal. Sister. Sorelli. So, Sorelli? Sorello. There's not an I. Okay, put it. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Sorella. 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 You say Sara. And instead of go Sar, you go Sarella. I love, the, I, I love the Italian language, and I'm just blessed that I'm part Italian. So, like, a big part of me. I'm know. so blessed to be black. I love black. the ghettoness. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, the next one, I'm going to do one more. The last one will be. I just told I'm, you. The last one I'm going to put down. I, I, I told you. When's your birthday? Oh, when is your birthday? I didn't know you did that. When I did said that? after that one, you did listen. When is your birthday? Let's see. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought we did this already. Let me see. Oh, no, you said what? How old are you? Yeah. It's oh, cumpleaños birthday. Cumpleaños in Spanish is see you. This one is see oh. Yeah. So it's, instead of cumple, it's cumple. Cuando es tu cumpleaños? Cuando? Like. Juan del tu cumpleaños. Okay, okay, okay. And the last one I'm gonna do is a, is a surprise for y'all. It's a little present. What is it? It's a curse word. Oh. And I'm not gonna say the curse word on here, but I will say it's got F and U in it. Okay? Okay. So. What is it? Va fan culo. Va fan culo. Like, va fan culo. Oh, we should do done Okay, I'm gonna do one more after this. Capiche. Yes, yes, yes. So this is F U in Italian. Va fan culo. He's, he's not loud. This guy's not. He's not. Va fan culo. And then. Um, understand? Understand? Capiche? Actually, it's not capiche. It's capire. Capire. What is capiche then? Capiche is like uh, a mocking version of calling. Capiche meaning? It's do you understand? Capiche, but it's spelled. See, see, they try to spell it that way. That's not how you spell it. Oh, yeah. They try to spell it like it sounds. Sound, 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 sound. sound. Yeah. What language is capiche? Capiche is C A P I N. Okay, so C A P. I S C E. It's a American pseudo, so it's it's slang. So oh. I told you, capire, capire is how you really. It. So capiche is slang for understand and functions rather like know what I mean, know what I mean, yeah. jelly bean, capiche. I'm start saying that. You know they have the emoji on the, the I'm gonna iPhone. I'm start saying that to people who don't. Uh, capiche, uh, capiche. <laughs> that's, another, that's another reason why it's very important to learn like different languages. They're, different languages. That way you can surprise people. Like you yeah. can like go to another country and just un fully understand everything they're saying. They're like, "Whoa, you're yeah. a white dude. How do you know what we're saying?" Or right. "You're a black person. How do you know what we're saying?" Or "You're an Asian. We're in. You're in like. You're in like Africa. How do you know? Well, I don't, Africa. Africa. I'm gonna let y'all know. Africa is probably a hard language because there's so many different languages and every country speaks different like different language, different yeah. uh, dialect of mm -hmm. it. And uh, but I ain't gonna lie. In general, Italian is my favorite language. It really is. Um, I don't know what it is about it, but it's just I'm obsessed with Italian movies ever since I was a baby. Uh, I, I, I watched The Godfather, the best movie ever. I watched The Godfather when I was like 10. I watched Scarface when I was like 11. Scarface is an Italian, but Al Pacino's Italian. He's the guy who played Scarface. But hey, if y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Yeah, Hopefully, you watched all the way to the end yeah. too and didn't skip. I know some people be skipping the video. Uh, gotta go past here now. So hopefully y'all enjoyed. Hopefully it wasn't boring. Smash the thumbs up. Yeah. Hopefully it was funny and entertaining. You learned something too. Hopefully you learned something. Educational purposes. Um, and uh, yeah, that's, yeah. It. that's it. So have a good day. Subscribe, comment, and we'll see you in the next video.